Good morning, everybody. It's Jen here, and I am back after a very long absence uh, from not posting any videos on my channel. I think it's been about three, maybe even four weeks, three weeks, uh, something like that. Crazy. It's been a crazy long time. I have been trying to adjust to my new job and um, get everything settled there, so uh, that's why I haven't been here. So I am here today with a layout that I did about three weeks ago using the hip kit. I combined several kits, so I think, what I think it is, I think it's June and July. I It could be July and August, I'm not, a, I think it's June and July, June and July, we're going to go with June and July. Um, it's the two that had a lot of the crepe paper poolside and some of the October afternoon summer line um, and all of that. So I combined both my kits uh, and put them together so I could, so I would have more to work with and hopefully do more layouts right off the bat instead of trying to kill one kit before moving on to the other. This is a photo of my uh, nephew Christopher and this was taken back in May, I believe when um, I had taken him to the park for the first time. This was his very first time on a swing and he absolutely loved it. So um, he was all smiles, giggling, laughing the entire time we were there and he loved it. So I am taking this October afternoon teal and white polka dot piece of paper and kind of making that my background layer um, and then building everything off of there. I also really enjoyed this multicolored stripe. This I don't think was from the kit. I think that I pulled from my stash. I think that's Scraptastic. Um, I could be wrong though. I'm pretty sure that's a sub Scraptastic exclusive paper that I just pulled from my stash because I thought it went really well with the polka dots. I kind of wanted polka dots and the stripes. So that's what I ended up doing there. Um, so, yeah, like I said, it's been a while. I am, I took a new job. I think I told you guys I took a new job as a guidance counselor in a high school, uh, charter high school. And the kids started on Wednesday was their first day. Uh, and I am the guidance counselor for grades 12 and 12 plus, which is essentially like a, this school senior year is two years long. Um, and the state pays for the 12 plus kids to take almost an entire full year of college for free. So it's really a great program. Um, and so that's, I've got the 12 and the 12 plus kids, all the seniors, and uh, I'm so far loving my job. Um, I really haven't been in my office yet uh, because their the 12 plus kids, their college classes don't start yet. They start this coming Wednesday. So I had a full, full day of full first day of school on when on last Wednesday when I was kind of jumping from classroom to classroom doing introductions and all of that and then Thursday Friday and tomorrow actually I have been out on a field on field trips with the 12 plus kids um, because we need to keep them accountable and we don't really have anything for them to do until the college classes started so we've been going out and touring colleges uh, doing the whole college you know, process uh, with them because a lot of these kids are very, very poor. Um, and they, if we, if the school didn't take them on college visits, they probably wouldn't go see any colleges. Their parents just don't have the means um, to get them, you know, to see all these colleges, maybe some of the local ones, but we've taken them um, down to Newport. We took them to Connecticut and tomorrow we're taking them to Boston. Um, so it's, it really is I think an awesome program for these kids um, and it's it the whole the whole school is based on uh, nursing these are all kids that want to go into a nursing school for college so it's really kind of neat to combine my two degrees my nursing and my counseling together so that's kind of what I have been up to the last couple of weeks um, trying to get everything all set for that job. And I, like I said, I'm loving it. It's been really cool. Um, my coworkers are phenomenal, which is a huge change because my previous job, um, most of them were not. So it's, I'm really enjoying it. So anyway, while I've been telling you a little bit about what's going on in my life, I went through and pulled out a whole bunch of embellishments. I also added in some of my uh, stash to this kit. I like to, I do subscribe to the Freckled Vaughn kit. So I've been finding I haven't been using them that much 
So now each kit I get, I pull a whole bunch of stuff from the, the Freckle Fawn kits and um, add them into whatever kit I'm working with. And it, I find that it really um, works out well. So I use some die cuts, a tag, some wood veneer, some epoxy stickers, just a little bit of everything. And this is just a fun, easy summer layout. Um, it was kind of, I enjoyed doing this. This is a little bit different, I feel like, than my normal um, in some ways, but in others, like more of the embellishing is a little bit different. But I enjoy doing it. I really like how it came out. Um, I really like those chipboard phrase stickers, the little titles almost. Uh, that came with the crepe paper poolside collection. I, that's the only one I've used so far is the summer, um, but I do, um, maybe that's not what I'm thinking. Maybe that came from the, I don't know if I have those spray stickers now that I think about it. Maybe it came from the chipboard, the 12 by 12 ch chipboard set. It might have, I don't know. Um, I'll have to go back and look. I, now that I think of it, I don't think I bought the phrase stickers separately. I was planning to, but I just never got around to it. Um, but I did put in these Amy Tan uh, epoxy stickers. I don't think they came with the kit. I think I put them in on my own. Um, and then the pool, the crepe paper pool side stickers here. I can't remember if they came with the kit or if I bought those. I can't even remember. It's so long ago now that I did this layout. I don't even remember how bad is that. Um, I've been so caught up in work and trying to get stuff done for that. I did, I didn't, I decided to do a title on top of just the summer uh, big chipboard and it's going to be swings and smiles or smiles and swings. One of the, I don't know if it, which way it makes it onto the layout, um, but that will pretty much finish up the layout. I do put the date on it, which was, oh, it looks like June 18th, June 11th. So maybe it was in June. Um, I thought it was earlier than that, but I guess not. So I'm going to use my T-square ruler to actually line it up because um, when it's on those stripes, I feel like it has to be lined up perfectly um, or it's going to really look awkward. So it ends up being smiles and swings, not swings and smiles, uh, because he was all smiles the entire time we were on the swings. He must have been on the swings for about a good f like 35 to 40 minutes. He absolutely loved it, which was kind of fun. Um, and so I have a whole bunch more photos to start scrapping. I, my plan is today is Monday, Labor Day, and I plan to be in my scrap room um, for the rest of the day. And I've got a whole bunch of vacation photos I want to do. So that'll be really fun. Hopefully I'll actually uh, do that instead of just find other things to do. So thank you guys so much for watching. That finishes my layout and I will see you hopefully soon. I can't really guarantee that, but hopefully. Um, I've got two more layouts done that just need voiceovers. Hopefully I can get those done so I can post them for you. All right, take care. Bye.